in 2018, the federal government of Nigeria set up the Presidential Infrastructural Development Fund, known as PID Fund. The PID Fund is currently financing three major projects in the country, which are Lagos Ibadan Expressway, the Second Niger Bridge, and Abuja Kaduna Zaria Kanu Road. I have been privileged to show the status of construction ongoing on the Lagos Ibadan Expressway and the Second Niger Bridge. You can click on the link above to watch what's going on with those projects. The video you are watching is courtesy of Julius Beja Construction PLC, which is the contractor handling the Abuja Kaduna Zaria Kanu Dua Carriage Highway, which is what we are discussing about in this video. The 375 km Abuja Kaduna Zaria Kanu Road is the longest of the PID fund projects and the road forms a critical part of the larger highway system, enabling the movement of people and products from the north to the south and vice versa. This highway is a part of the A2 Trans-Africa Highway, a network comprising transcontinental road construction projects in Africa. The construction of this road project is in three phases, which are Phase 1 from Zuba Junction in Abuja to Kaduna West Bypass with a total distance of 165 km. Phase 2 Kao Bridge Junction in Kaduna to Zaria with a total distance of 73.40 km. Phase 3 Zaria Town to Kaduna with a total distance of 137 kilometers. Julius Berger has pioneered the use of innovative cold recycling methodology, which is known as cold in place recycling (CIR). The CIR is an efficient and environmentally friendly solution which involves milling off existing asphalt-based cores, then recycling them with hot bitumen and cement to serve as base layer for new asphalts, making the road more durable and stronger. This methodology has numerous benefits. The new road will have an increased bearing capacity compared to the previous pavement constructed with granular base cores, leading to an extended lifespan. This methodology is also environmentally friendly. The Abuja Kaduna Zaria Road construction was reviewed from mere renovation to complete reconstruction with extra lanes on either side of the road and construction of 13 new pedestrian bridges. This road is expected to be completed in three phases 
of December 2022, March 2023, and second quarter of 2023. Let's go. 